Question 8. In the diagram, O, A, B, C, D is a pyramid with vertex D. The horizontal base O, A, B, C is a square of side 4 units. The edge O, D is vertical and O, D is 4 units. The unit vectors I, J, and K are parallel to O, A, O, C, and O, D respectively. The midpoint of A, B is M, and the point N on C, D is such that D, N is 3 times N, C. A. Find a vector equation for the line through M and N. We first need to find out O, M and O, N. Uh, M we know that it's OA plus AM. OA plus AM. And OA is 4I. AM, since M is the midpoint of AMB, so AM is 2J. Therefore, OM is 4I plus 2J. We know that OD is 4K and OC is 4J. And DN is 3 times NC. Uh, be careful here. The question in here, it doesn't use the vector um, format for you. So you're going to be careful here. DN is 3 times NC. Uh, DN and NC are in the same direction. Uh, you cannot use dn as 3 times cn, because cn is minus nc, so be careful here. Uh, dn is on minus od. nc is oc minus on. Therefore, uh, on minus od is 3 times oc minus 3 times on. So on is 3 times OC plus OD over 4. OC, we know, is 4J. Uh, put it in here. OD is 4K. Put it in here. We get ON is 3J plus K. Now we have both OM and ON. We can find out the direction vector. And M. And M is OM minus ON, which is 4I minus J minus K. That's the direction vector. And we can use either M or N as the reference point. Therefore, the vector equation of line through M and N is R equals, uh, we use M as a reference point, it becomes 4I plus 2J plus T times uh, 4I minus J minus K. B. Show that the length of the perpendicular from O to MN is uh, one third of, of, of root 82. We know that the, uh, from um, part A, we know that the uh, uh, equation of the line is uh, 4i plus 2j plus t times 4i minus j minus k. Suppose that the foot of the perpendicular is P, and we know that P is on line MN. Therefore, it should uh, satisfy uh, the line equation. Uh, we rewrite the line equation as 4 plus 4Ti plus 2 times Tj minus Tk, uh, OP should be in this format. And since OP is perpendicular to MN, we know that OP dot the direction vector for I minus J minus K is 0. Now, OP is perpendicular to MN, therefore OP, uh, this is OP, dot uh, the direction vector for I minus J minus K should be 0 because they're perpendicular. Uh, this is 4 times 4 plus 4t minus 2 times uh, 2 minus t plus t. 
is equal to 18t plus 14, uh, this should be 0. Therefore, t is minus 7 over 9. Put this t back into this line equation, or the combined line equation here. Uh, we get 4 plus 4t is 8 over 9. And minus 2 minus t is 25 over 9. Uh, the lines of the perpendicular should be the modulus or magnitude of OP. OP is in this format, so it should be 8 over 9 squared plus 25 over 9 squared plus 7 over 9 squared. Uh, OP is in this format, and the magnitude of OP is the length of the perpendicular. Uh, use your calculator, you can find that um, it's one-third times root 82.